For centuries, the Green Man legend has captivated the imaginations of people all over the world. In England, this mythical figure, with a face made entirely of leaves, branches, and foliage, represents nature's regenerative power, as well as the life and death cycle. The Green Man emerges as a symbol of new growth and fertility as spring awakens on Earth. He was associated with the forest god in pagan traditions and was used in religious ceremonies and celebrations. The green man became associated with the Christian concept of resurrection and eternal life as Christianity spread throughout England. The green man's image can be found in medieval church and cathedral carvings all over Europe. These intricate carvings, which frequently depict face or heads surrounded by leaves and branches, represent nature's enduring power as well as that life-death cycle. The green man is carved in hidden corners and on the ceilings in these magnificent structures. One of the most well-known depictions of the green man can be found in Somerset's Wells Cathedral. His likeness is carved into the stone figures that adorn the roof, and he is surrounded by animals and foliage. Misericords in St. Mary's Church in Beverly, East Yorkshire, depicts the green man in various poses with leaves and vines growing from his mouth and ears, surrounded by animals. This highlights his role as a protector of the forest and its inhabitants. While the green man has become a cultural icon in England, his significance extends beyond heritage. The green man has become a symbol for the environmental and conservation organizations who use his image to raise awareness of the importance of protecting the planet and preserving the natural world. The green man can be found in modern art and architecture, including a massive green man sculpture made of recycled materials at the Eden Project in Cornwall. The green man has also influenced modern garden designs, such as topiary figures and foliage-covered living walls. He represents nature's enduring power, spiritual and mystical connections to the natural world, cultural heritage, and identity. While the Green Man and the Guardians of the Galaxy character Groot share some similarities, it's unclear whether Groot was specifically inspired by the Green Man. However, the character could have been influenced by a variety of mythical, cultural traditions, emphasizing the importance of nature and the interconnectedness of all living things. Overall, the Green Man represents nature's enduring power. He continues to enchant people all over the world, but his ties to England are especially strong. These are interesting things with J.C.